With sponsors, coaches, parents, and over 50 youngsters in attendance, the program started with a short opening ceremony at the St. Anthony Secondary School football field. Principal and owner Mrs. John Bullius Callias said the students were very enthusiastic about the event. St. Anthony's is a school dedicated, yes, to the academics, but also to all other facets of education. And sports is definitely a major part here at St. Anthony's. And that is why, as principal, I decided we had to yeah, close the classrooms and just get on with it, football at St. Anthony's. And we're happy to have our two coaches from Tottenham. We hope that you enjoy your stay here. These students here behind me are dying to get onto that field um, <laughs> for days now. It's been, are they here yet? Yesterday. What time's the plane? Is it on time? What difference does it make to you? You're not going to see them till tomorrow. And that's how it's been for a while now. Also present were president of the Antigua and Barbuda Football Association, Everton Bato Gonzalez, who encouraged the participants to work hard and improve their skills. Gonzalez noted that education and youth development form part of the Antigua and Barbuda Football Association policy. Principles that are enunciated on a daily basis at this wonderful educational institution is all about. I'm also happy that we have seen it fit to also awake the youths, awake them so that they can rise and shine. Just like the wonderful sun is rising and shining, the students of St. Anthony's and indeed students from the entire nation of Antigua and Barbuda with this exercise will certainly have an opportunity to rise and shine. Education and youth development are two pillars of the Antigua and Barbuda Football Association which we hold greatly to our hearts. Coaches Miles Layton and Ryan Hall said they were here to impart Tottenham Hotspur philosophy. Um, we can't wait to get started uh, this week. Um, it's going to be something different that we want to get across to the guys. It's our, our philosophy at Tottenham Hotspur, which is uh, it's based on one one v one domination uh, and individual excellence. So there's going to be a lot of stuff incorporating a ball leech here. So it's, it might be something different to what the guys are used to, um, but if we can get our way across of how we do it, um, we hope to develop these players. Over 90 kids are participating in the five-day training program, which is slated to end on Sunday with a two-hour coaching clinic followed by competitive matches between the participants. Vernon Edwards Jr. for ABS Sports.